Never gonna leave, never gonna leave your side. Oh, never leave your side. In the eye of the storm. It's your brother J.D. Nija. I'm out. I'm out on the um, fire ring. See, we have the mountains back there. See the snow on the mountains? This is quintessential California winter. Clear skies. You can see for miles and miles and miles. And uh, the beach is full of hardcore beach people only. And uh, the spirit is strong because those wicked holidays are over. So, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to read. I was thinking about, um, what was I thinking about? I don't know. We'll find out. Um, we'll go to Romans 16, 18. All praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rekakwadash. Here I am on the beach fighting the wind get the scriptures and Romans was recently so here I am Romans 16 7 15 no Corinthians oh damn let's see I'll get it 8 Romans 9 Romans 11 Romans 16 at the end of the book so what was it that I was thinking about Romans 16 18 it says for they that are such okay avoid them that cause division shoot I just was here that's funny now I beseech you brethren make them which cause divisions and offenses contrary to the doctrine which you have learned and avoid them Verse 18, for they that are such serve not our Lord Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, but their own belly and give good words and fair speeches, deceive the hearts of the simple. So I guess I'm coming back to the same thing, obedience and um, discipline. Because it says in 19, for your obedience, For your obedience has come abroad unto all men. I am glad, therefore, on your behalf, but yet I would have you wise unto that which is good and simple concerning evil. So I must have been somewhere talking about what it means to be. What is this evil that we're talking about? Here comes, is this my friend? I don't know. Is that Lonnie? No. <laughs> Uh, that's the um, <laughs> that's the guy that's the <laughs> he does the um, he's an operator you can tell he hates his job he's like one of those guys that man he's making his money but he doesn't want to be there I can see myself in him so um what we're talking about is um Man, the evil is so obvious, and we think it's not. Maybe that, maybe, maybe the reason I went to that is because I'm upside down here. Okay, so here I am. <laughs> that was yesterday's lesson. No wonder I came back to that. So um, I'm going to do today's lesson, 15:1 of Romans. Derp, derp, derp. Romans 15:1. So I was on rebellion and 
um, deceit. And today I want to talk about man, Romans must have small chapters because it's like you kidding me. 15.1 is um, be like minded. So it reads we then that are strong ought to bear the infirmities of the weak and not to please ourselves. Let every one of us please his neighbor for his good to edification. So I guess I'm going towards um, what it means to be a servant. And if we're strong, we're supposed to be coming out here and saying so. Right? So I'm going to go to 1 Corinthians, see if, see if that's where I'm at. I don't know. I just, I'm coming out here to do a message and it's beautiful and I've had a good day and a good weekend and all the devil shit has passed and now I'm just kind of trying to say, all right, that stuff's passed, let's see where we're at now and I'm not going to push it, I'm going to let the Holy Spirit guide me. So I'm, uh, I also went to 1 Corinthians 13, 14 and it reads... Yeah, there's no 13, 14. Wouldn't you, wouldn't you know it? Let's see what else we have in here. Um, Doth not behave itself un, unseemly, seeketh not her own, is not easily provoked, thinketh no evil, rejoices not in iniquity, but rejoices in the truth, beareth all things, believeth all things, hopeth all things, endureth all things. So I think I'm in that um, mode of. Man, you can't give it away. You can't, you can't give it away. Let's see. I'm going to go to Timothy. That's the final. That's the final verse of what I was um, thinking about. And uh, we'll see if I can, if the Holy Spirit, between you, me, and the book, we can figure out what it is that he wanted me to talk about and why I'm on this video right now sitting on the... <laughs> I'm sitting on the fire pit. See the fire pits? I'm sitting on one of these fire pits. And my truck is over there. But I'm right here. And I'm going to 1 Timothy 1.16 to figure out is there going to be any surf in the next couple weeks so I can actually get myself back? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't need to surf. I don't need to be that guy to uh, to know myself, but it is a big part of me. First Timothy, First Timothy one sixteen reads, "Howbeit for this cause I obtained mercy, that in me first Yahushai Hamashiach might show forth all long suffering for a pattern. Patterns are changing." For a pattern. Patterns are changing. So that's part of the story. Let's say for for a pattern to them which should be hereafter hereafter belief on him to life everlasting. So I just realized what the message for today was is about patience. Man, these devils are drawing everything out. They're drawing everything out. And we're ma they're making us think peace, peace and safety and all that. I'm going to walk back to the truck because the message is over. Don't you see the mountains? If you can see them behind that. Um, I'm moving around a little bit, but see the snow on the mountains back there? Beautiful. It's the best time of the year in California when the rain comes and the cold comes and the sun leaves us alone a little bit because sometimes in the summer it's just too damn hot and you people back east and in the south know too hot, too muggy, too too miserable. Here's my truck, I'm coming in. So patience, patience, patience. We're coming into a season where 
It's a lucky brothers. Uh, let me get in the truck. Oh. Hey, shalom, shalom. My message for today would be patience is going to be key. It's going to be key coming up. If you're anxious and wild and expecting and pushing and you're going to step in some crazy shit and you might get tripped up. So Israel, be patient. First two days of this year, at least here in California right here, have been awesome. Beautiful. Mostly because everyone's in their house, staying home, being good little humans. Esau has us running around like fools. And um, that's been something that's bothered me for a long time is why are people running so hard to the point where they're hurting each other and mad at each other? Slow down. Wait for the Lord. Be still. That would probably be the one, if there was one verse that I was looking for out of this patience video that I'm doing right now. It would be, I think it's in Psalms. You can pull it up if you want. It's easy. I'm the guy that will um, give you the theme and you have to find the scripture. So the theme is, be still and know that I am your power or be still and know that I am your Lord. Be still and know that I am God. I'm not a, a dress guy and a scripture guy. I'm a theme guy. So the theme is if you want to find that verse, you can, you can find... miles and miles of truth behind that one scripture. Be still and know that I am your power. Be still and know that I am your Lord. Be still and know that I am God. I don't know where it's at. I'm just saying I know what that means. I'm a story guy. You got to know the story to get the glory. All praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rekakwadash, the Heavenly Father, the only begotten Son, and the Holy Spirit. Tomorrow's work, I'll see you bright and early. Grouchy again, ready to go <laughs> Monday morning. Meh. Nah. But I love you, Israel. If this video is edifying and you understand what I'm saying about patience is key right now, then push that subscribe button. Be a part of J Coffee with JD Nyjah in the morning. And uh, you don't need to push the notification button. I'm, I'm consistent as that manna that fell from heaven for the Israelites when they came out of Egypt. That, that ship fell every morning. You know why? Because the manna is the food of life, and the food of life is this word. And this word I am told to feed the sheep. Till tomorrow morning, Israel, I love you. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. And I'll do the same.
We'll see you tomorrow. This is your brother, J.D. Nijah. I'm out.